Burns are a real problem. Uh, anybody who's using heating pads on your puppies, don't. Heating pads are a problem. Heating pads are very unreliable. Um, the best heating pads in the world will still get hot spots or sometimes you'll have a problem. So I would tell you if you have puppies, if you have your dogs and you want to heat them up, don't use heating pads. Uh, yes. I don't use a heating pad, though. I have this thing that looks like a Frisbee and I put it in the microwave and heat it up sort of like a hot water bottle. Yeah. That's what I would use. That's okay. Yeah, use that wrapped in towels. Yeah. yeah. But don't use heating pads. I have seen nothing but problems with, uh, especially a lot of vets that used to use heating pads. Post up, the whole back would be burned. Okay, oh. you'd have really bad burns. Yeah. So, if you have a burn, if one of your dogs gets burned for whatever reason, hot oil, hot whatever, uh, cold water pack, get a uh, washcloth with some water, get some gauze pads, whatever, put it on the wound, hold it in place, get it to the vet. What's the biggest problem with burns? Infection. Infection. Nope. Dehydration. Okay, because they can't keep their uh, they can't keep themselves hydrated because there's nothing protecting them. So the biggest problem is not or not only infection, which is a problem, but dehydration. And that's usually a few days down the line. Right away, get them to the vet, get them to bride it, get them on fluids, you know, whatever they're going to do. But get them as, as fast as you can. Uh, you can try washing off the oil with the cold water, or you can try cleaning the wound with cold water. But for the most part, cover it, get them, get them as fast as you can.